has been, are you, love? That's right. We just stopped the swans in now for a massive layers off. For me, it always had the, the ingredients. You know, as soon as I was told it, I couldn't really believe it, um, which is always a good sign, I think. If you're told a story and you go, I don't, no way, it's always a good sign that you're onto something. Um, it just seemed to me to have all the elements. Um, I love the idea of those two communities coming together, imagining, you know, 30 years ago, a very remote Welsh village full of miners, how they would respond to a minibus arriving full of gay and lesbians. You know, that, an incredible, to me, the images already, um, and the comedy already started to write itself, really. It was irresistible, and I was thrilled that nobody else had thought of it. <laughs> Come meet everybody. Name you the group or organization you represent in this case. Lesbians and gays support the minors. Quite, absolutely. Now, I'm hoping you can clear something up for me about lesbians. Okay. It's something I was told in the covered market. Let's now, get what's settled in first, shall we? It takes a lot of energy to make a film, but um, having such, such a funny group of people, yeah, yeah. hilarious, really, talented, brilliantly talented, who understood the uh, importance of being truthful, and they understood the importance of the ensemble supporting everybody working at their best in order to support each other rather than trying to steal a scene, for example, or, you know, make it about them. So um, they, were, they, they were all perfect for the part. The reason the cast is so good is because the material is so good. They cared so much about the true life events. They wanted to be part of any endeavour that was going to get that, that uh, story to a bigger uh, wider public and the the the, uh, the script the dialogue is uh, wonderful wonderfully written as well what the hell do you think you're doing I'm just talking to Kev about something get out there and find a gay or a lesbian right now you don't have the wrong impression right because you're so bloody irresistible <laughs> Almost everyone in the film is playing a part smaller than they would normally play. Mm. You know, so we have this incredible, you know, people really, we're, we're punching above our weight in every respect. Um, but, you know, there's something about that, everyone together. In, in, in a, and, you know, when we, we started filming in Wales, we were two weeks in Wales, and that kind of bonded us. So by the time we came to London again, we were like a theatre company, you know, um, everyone working together. So it was extraordinary. We had a great time. I don't mind taking more. Not the lesbians so much because of their cuisine, but I'll take an extra gay. I do think it's this, it's a big surprise. Uh, whatever preconceptions you bring to the film, you think you might like, particularly like or not like, it's not, it's not what you're expecting. And fortunately, uh, in a positive way, people, f people find it to be very refreshing, uh, surprisingly uplifting, surprisingly moving. And I think it's because it's honest. It's, it's, uh, it's about, uh, it captures the, uh, the truth of life in all of its sort of varied emotions and colours. It's a very rich um, film. I think people are hungry for material that means something as well as entertaining. Yeah, it's very much, for me, it's the, the truth of the story. It, you, know when, well, you know when things happen in life and somebody says, you couldn't make it up? I didn't. That's because the truth is the truth is what makes it unique, and it's as Matthew says, that's why it will surprise you because all the things that happen in it are true and truly extraordinary. You see what we've done here? They pledge in our friendship.